What I would like to see for NTIC going forward is an expansion of our services always. Again, going back to being a nonprofit in education, we're uniquely positioned to be able to offer and to really go with the times of change. So a few years back, obviously, the natural gas industry came about. So we had a lot of our employers reach out to us about opportunities there. Uh, we were able to quickly and um, efficiently set up a summer experience for the oil field gas industry. It's a week-long program, and um, so we're very fortunate that way. Uh, a, a big portion of my job is really understanding the workforce development and the workforce needs here in the northern tier. What does it look like five years from now? And so from my perspective is I'm always looking ahead to see healthcare is a big industry here. Manufacturing is a big industry here. What's the next step or what does it look like in the five, ten years? So that's something that I look into, um, statistics, facts, evidence-based around work or workforce development. I would like to see NTIC obviously offer more services around different sectors. Not only that, but um, what are the needs of the school district? You know, we're seeing a change that, you know, it's not the four-year degrees. It's not pushing them to higher education. It's getting these students out in the workforce quicker, faster, dual enrollments at colleges, which I think is a phenomenal way to go about because it's really only getting these students into family-sustaining wages, which is the end result. Uh, we don't want a 30-year-old sitting in mom-and-pop's basement. <laughs> um, because they can't afford a job or they can't afford this because they're in so much debt and, you know, um, it's unfortunate because we see that a lot. Um, long term, another goal that I look for is maybe perhaps we expand um, into different territories as well. You know, we do have such a wide range. We have a satellite office located in Mansfield, but it would be nice to see them perhaps located in southeast Pennsylvania, wherever that may be, or perhaps even um, Southwest, so.